Well, like like I said, so many girls were visiting their grandmas, and uh, so they weren't they weren't uh, they weren't here long. And, and kind of like it is today, they're, they're very transient. They weren't, um, you know, the people here. They, they were just here for a, a weekend or a week. So you meet girls and you like them, and all of a sudden they're gone. So that that was kind of sad. I had a steady girlfriend at the time from a sort semi steady from 1970 five to 87 she was an older lady so not being mean but i i fooled around on her 21 years older wow yeah so she was much older so i no i'll tell you what happened uh, I, I put it on facebook recently you might have seen a picture of her uh, on her birthday 11 years ago she was in a car wreck and she got killed in california but we weren't together but we were still we were still friends she would be alive if, if that didn't happen she was in great shape but that was very that was one of the, that was one of the saddest things uh, that ever affected me because we were still good friends. And so we were together from 75 to 87, but you know, every so often uh, I'd meet somebody and she was working and you know, we had a little thing going. She'd get mad, she'd get, uh, you know, I don't want to see you no more. And then all of a sudden she'd show up again. So I got away with a lot of stuff. I was young and got away with stuff. I could never, I could never do that now. But I don't, I don't know. I, it's got to be harder these days, because there they came. They there was no young guys, so they see a young guy, and you, you almost surely would get a date if you were in pretty good shape. You get a date. The only young guys were the lifeguards and a couple, couple strays. So, I think I think. Uh, but there wasn't any girls. There was hardly any girls.